we have made our way south from Phnom Penh on a 45 minute ferry to honestly one of the most stunning and beautiful islands in Cambodia, Koron. Honestly, look at that behind me. It's picture perfect. Now we've got a lot planned for today. First up, we're hiring a scooter for the next couple of hours and we're gonna go explore the island. After that, we've got a boat tour that's gonna to take us snorkeling, we're gonna go fishing, and we're gonna go see the glowing night plankton. Okay, so we get back at 8 p.m. tonight, so let's go. Go that way. A little bit. After you said a little bit and then all you can clear out. Yes. Go to sled. This way. And you have come back the same, come way. Back the same way. Okay. Because it's all sand. This yeah, and it will take too long. Big, so big maybe you let the board, you know. Yeah. So we'll just come back that way. Oh no man, passing by. Life is good, best I've ever felt. Get me up, so in it, so I can't find myself. I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel so alive As I reach out reach out reach out reach out reach out to the sky Oh I feel I feel I feel I feel so alive As I reach out reach out reach out reach out to the sky I found my way I found my way I was in the dark against it all but made it through the day cuz I found my way I found my way We've been exploring the island for a couple of hours now and we have gone past some absolutely beautiful beaches. One of them being a beach called Long Beach. So if you do have a couple of hours to kill here, uh, I highly recommend picking up a scooter and heading down to Long Beach. It's really, really hot here. So what we've done is we've found a great little spot. It's called Soksan Beach. If you can see in the background, looks absolutely beautiful. So we're gonna refresh. We're gonna get some water, try and find some fruit because we have to head back at 1 p.m. for our boat tour. So we just jumped on our tour boat, you can just here in the background, it's just started it up, 
Um, now, if you are looking to take the scooter out here in Karong, highly recommend it. You know, the island isn't too big. I'd probably say it would take you a couple of hours to go all the way around. Now, it cost us, generally it costs you 10 US dollars per day. We only had the scooter for um, a couple of hours. So he only ended up charging us $6, which is really nice of him. Now, if you are looking to take this uh, boat tour, Highly recommend it. I've actually done it before and it's really, really good. I could find it. Um, okay, started it up, but this boat tour cost us 15 US dollars each. Okay, so let's go. <laughs> just got to our first snorkeling spot where it was about 15 minutes away on the boat and we've just gone about 100 meters off this island here so we're about 100 meters off I'm just about to jump in but I'm going to introduce you to our tour guide so meet our tour guides what was your name bro my name is Paul Paul yeah, yeah. what's your name man so oh. oh and Tol and Paul gonna jump in let's go I've just snorkeled across to this little island. You can see our boat in the background. You can see that. There's honestly, there's not too much on this island. Uh, they've got this long pathway or mini bridge that kind of goes around. So I'm gonna walk all the way around to see if there's anything worth checking out. Our tour guide did say that there is uh, a tiny little temple or a tiny little statue so I'm going to try and find that but the island is tiny the, the island's not very big at all so it shouldn't take me too long I'm gonna head back down to the boat now. I think we're about to leave. Um, I think this is our first snorkeling spot and then we're gonna go to one extra one after this. Um, after that, we are gonna go fishing. So we don't actually have fishing rods. What we got is just fishing lines that we're gonna dangle over the edge. Now, tour guide did say that he does catch fish pretty much every single time he takes people out a couple of kilos each time so hopefully we do have some fish to cook at the end of the tour hopefully we might have some fish for dinner Stopped off at our fishing spot where we have received our fishing line and we try and catch some fish. So we've just been dropped off at Long Beach and we've got about an hour here to kill before dinner tonight and so far we've done two things. We've been snorkeling 
and snorkeling was pretty fun. Yeah, it was really, really good. There was, I'm actually surprised how much fish we saw and coral and sea urchins. Um, and where we stopped as well, we were at like an island and Clint actually went up to the island. Um, and, and they it, had like a little temple on there, which was a bit random, but pretty cool. Yeah, so I had a temple. I went up there, um, which you, you guys will see. Um, second, we went fishing. So we, we didn't have fishing rods, but we had fishing lines. And Steph and I, we didn't catch any fish. No, no we fish. Didn't, no fish for us. Uh, we did have others that did catch fish, but they were just tiny fish. Uh, I think what we're gonna do for dinner is we're gonna cook up that fish, and they do have fried rice for us as well, and water. Yeah. Okay. Which is, good. Which is good, yeah, because it's quite hot today. So um, after that, we're gonna go see the glowing plankton. Yeah, I'm really excited for that. That one should be good. And after that, uh, that pretty much finishes up the tour. The tour finishes at 8 p.m. Okay, and it's gonna take us back to where we began. So we've just finished our barbecue on the boat. It's really delicious. We've got chicken skewers and rice. Check it out. How's yours? Good. Good. Honestly, what more can you ask for? You've got a barbecue and you got that sunset. So we just finished up with the tour. Uh, definitely recommend it. Right at the end there, we did do the plankton. Yeah, that was amazing. That was really, really cool. I was really actually cool. really shocked. I was just thinking it might be like a few plankton, but literally the whole water just like lit up as you swam through it. It was crazy. And yeah, we, all, it was. we jumped in. Yeah, we all jumped in. We Everybody on goggles. our joke, we all jumped in, got our snor snorkel goggles on. And just, yeah, when you wave your hand around, your whole hand just lights up. It's, it's amazing. So definitely recommend it. Yeah, for sure. 15 US dollars each and um, it's definitely worth the money, 100%. Yeah, there's food, we got dinner as well on the, on the boat. They gave us um, some snacks throughout the day, unlimited drinks, and then obviously all the different sites that we went to as well, like $15 per person was- Really good. Really good value, so definitely recommend. Yep. Now, tomorrow we are heading to Vietnam, Ho Chi Minh City. So we got, I think it's a six, six hour, Six hour bus ride um, back to Phnom Penh and then from Phnom Penh we're going over to Ho Chi Minh City which is another five and a half hours. So our next video will be from Vietnam. See you then.